Good morning Year 6, today we are going to make some healthy apple and cinnamon muffins. I hope you enjoy making them for your family or just following along. There is only natural sugar in them, so there's pretty healthy ingredients. It's not going to be healthy if you eat all of them, but it's a healthy alternative for our baking this week. Enjoy and send me a picture of what you make. So these are the ingredients for our apple and cinnamon healthy muffins. We have got 250 grams of oats that I've already measured out, two eggs, two teaspoons of baking powder. We've got ground nutmeg, ground ginger and ground cinnamon for all those lovely flavours. I've got my apples, 200 grams of apples. Make sure you weigh it after they've been chopped up. I've grated some and chopped some, just slightly different texture. We'll need four tablespoons of honey and 80 millilitres of milk, I've gone with oat milk, and then I've already melted so that it can cool down 16 millilitres of coconut oil. So they are our ingredients. All of the ingredients I've chosen are vegan except for the eggs, so just exchange these for flaxseed eggs or the aquafaba you could use as well. It's up to you, so you hopefully anyone can make these. So the first thing I'm going to do is put my oats into a blender and just whiz them up so they're a fine consistency, more like flour. I'm going to add a pinch of salt, one level teaspoon of ground nutmeg, a teaspoon of ground ginger and two teaspoons of ground cinnamon. I've also added in my two teaspoons of baking powder and I'm just going to mix my dry ingredients together. The smell of all the spices is amazing. I've added in my four tablespoons of honey and I'm going to add in my 80 millilitres of oat milk. I'm also going to pour in my 60 millilitres of coconut oil and mix up the ingredients. Crack into your bowl two eggs and mix up. We are now ready to fold in our apples. Spoon the mixture into your muffin cases until they are just nearly up to the top. And they are ready to go in the oven. You will need to cook your healthy muffins for 30 minutes on 180 degrees. Make sure you've preheated your oven. Whilst my cakes are cooking, I'm going to wash up, then I'll show you how to make some delicious icing. For the icing, mix together 200 grams of cream cheese. I've gone with a 50% less fat one to make it a little bit more healthy. Then one tablespoon of honey and two teaspoons of cinnamon and mix it all together. After it's all mixed together, put it in the fridge until you're ready to use it. Take them out of the oven and when you're able to, put them on a cooling rack to cool. Make sure your apple and cinnamon muffins are completely cool before you ice them. I've just had the idea to make some apple crisps for on top. I know some of you have made these before, so I've just literally sliced up some apples. And they're going to go in the oven for 10 minutes on each side. Just whilst they are cooling, I would say that if I was going to make them again, I would cut up my bits of apple a little bit smaller. I just think it would be overall a bit better. But they look delicious and they smell delicious, so I hope you're able to make these too. After your muffins are completely cool, you can put a dollop of icing on top of each one, and then because of what's in the icing, you'll need to keep them in the fridge. And I've decorated the healthy muffins with my apple crisps. So I have just tasted one of the healthy muffins and they are actually delicious. I love that they are still sweet, even though there's not any unnatural sugar in there. There's just honey and the apple giving it the flavour. And the spices taste so good and I love that they are healthy as well. It'll be a good post-run snack. I think I might save one for tomorrow. And then I'm going to go and deliver some to my family. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed our healthy baking alternative this week. Please send me a picture and let me know how you get on. Keep safe and I'll see you soon.